What is going on everyone? I am Nuxpro and welcome to this Escape from Tarkov quest guide. After watching this video, you will be able to complete the quest, Corporate Secrets, whether you're a bear or a Yusek. Let's get into it, mother <laughs> To complete this quest, you must get two items in the water treatment plant on the map Lighthouse and successfully extract with them. The first item is in the northern building in the water treatment plant. And the second item is in the western building. So first for each item, we're going to do a map overview of the route we're going to take to get the item because you have to kill rogues. There's no way to do this without killing rogues unless they're already dead. And then we're going to go in game and actually show you how to uh, accomplish this. Remember, we're going to be talking about bear and Usec. I will put timestamps below so you can navigate through the video if you want to go to a specific part and also don't forget to subscribe we're almost at 14,300 subscribers and i would love to quit my current full-time job do this for a living so let's go over the first quest item and this is the easy one this is located in the western building so this the rogues you got to worry about while going to the western building are going to be the two at the front here. So there's going to be one here, one here, roughly they're in little gun towers. Then you have to worry about the two rogues actually on top of the building. So there's one here and there's one here. So if let's go over USEC first, cause it's pretty easy. If you're a USEC, you can, you can, you can pretty much go anywhere here and these rogues aren't going to bother you as long as you don't get too close, but to keep it safe, just go to the side of the bridge. Just go along the beach here. Uh, don't hit the minefield, go through the, whatever this is, cove rock formation. And you literally don't have to kill any rogues. Cause by the time you get over here around the rocks. And like I said, we're going to go in game and show you this. This rogue isn't going to be able to see you because there is a uh, like a metal panel here. So he's not going to be able to shoot you. So as long as you go here and you go in and you hug the wall here and you go in the door, you're going to have no rogue shooting at you. There's no rogues in this building. So you're literally just going to walk in grab your item and you're going to go back the same way you came and hopefully hopefully you have the northern extract or the car and you can easily get out with your quest item now if you're a bear this is a little more complicated because you actually have to kill at least one rogue to go through this without a problem so if you are a bear you're going to start on the construction site down here all the way down here so in this construction site, there's a little trailer with some metal stairs here. You're going to go up the stairs. You are going to get line of sight on the rogue over here. You are going to kill this rogue. We're going to kill him. Bang. Now from there, you will be able to proceed the same way, the same route we took as a USEC. You'll go down the road, you go along the side of the bridge and you'll go here. Now, the last obstacle you're going to have to deal with is this rogue here. Now, when this rogue gets killed, this rogue can do three things. He can either stay on the gun right there. Doesn't even move. Wouldn't be a problem. He can come off the gun and like some he'll like come off and like stand in the front here somewhere, which wouldn't really be an issue for you uh, in regards to this quest or he will jump on to this gun. Now, if he jumps onto this gun, if you're going along the beach here, he's going to shoot at you and kill you. So and I'm going to show you this in the, when we go in game, you come here, there's like a rock somewhere here and you'll, you'll just take a peek at the tower. If he's there, you kill him. If he's not too easy You proceed and you literally go through the, the cove or whatever it's called, the grotto and come around the rocks here you're going to be in the same spot as the usec and again you come in you go around the gate you hug along the wall you go inside you get your quest item 
you go back the same way you came and hopefully you got the northern extract or the uh car extract as discussed this is what we are going to do if we are a bear holy rain <laughs> all right that's why we got the thermal but we are at the construction site as we talked about remember we just want to kill this one rogue at the front gate by coming up on these stairs here there he is and he's dead now we're not going to worry about the second one to the right he might run onto this tower but we will deal with that if we need to as we make our way to the left under the bridge So once we get here, we are looking for the possibility of the other gunner jumping on the gun of the rogue we just killed. So you can come over here and peek. It does not appear that he jumped on. So we are free to move across the beach. Stay close to the water so you don't hit any mines. We'll take this little path here. Remember, we are here to complete the quest, not get XP or rogue farm. So I'm not going to worry about, you know, killing rogues. So we're at the Western building. We need to go inside. There are two rogues on the roof. The one is probably over there manning the gun. He's not going to bother us. And then we have the rogue right here. He's not going to bother us because of these uh, metal uh, panels. Now, the only issue you could possibly run across is, well, is getting shot by the rogues on the eastern building. To avoid that, just hug the building to the left. So you're going to come like this. If you have high enough, high enough strength, you can jump this. If not, just go around real quick. Hug the building. Small chance you'll run into uh, one of the roaming rogues. Um, maybe we'll have a line of sight on you. Highly doubt it, but just keep that in mind. Hug to the left, hug to the left, and you will be in the building. Now, once you're inside, there is nothing to worry about. This clip is from when I completed the quest earlier in the wipe, and I didn't really know where the rogue spawned. So I'm being extra cautious. There shouldn't be any rogue in here to bother you. You're going to come up to this office here on the left. And you're going to go pick yourself up the binder or the clipboard. And now you just have to extract to complete this half of the quest. Now, the way you want to leave is the exact same way you came in. You don't want to go the other way because you're going to run into the rogues on top of the northern building. Just uh, go the same way you came in. Hug the wall to the right there. Jump over the gate. And hopefully from here you have the northern extract or the car extract. Now, how to get the second item? A little more complicated. You got to do a little more uh, legwork to get this done. And always remember, if there's other people in the game killing rogues, uh, you can kind of wait for them to kill all the rogues and then you can proceed. But um, if you have to do it yourself, this is what we're going to do. So the second item is in the northern building here. It's uh, actually the office is over there inside. But let's zoom in a little more. All right. So what we have to worry about here are in this box i'm drawing here we have our roaming patrol of four rogues now as of right now uh april 2022 they do not come out of this box it's not like killa where they're gonna go chasing you they just stay in this box they can spawn over here they can spawn over here uh they can be on the side in in rare cases they can be in the back over here 
on in the grass, but or they can be actually inside the building. Now that's the four roaming rogues. Then we also have to worry about the three rogues that are actually on top of the building. So there's one on the gun here. There's one on the gun here. So this guy's facing this way. You got this guy facing the train yard. And then number three, he's facing out here. So he's probably, he's gonna be the guy we're gonna be kind of focusing on here. So total of seven rogues to worry about. We also have to worry about the two rogues on top of this building. So there's one guy who like roams. He doesn't have a gun or anything. Then there's this guy on the gun. So one step at a time. So this is what we're going to do. We're going to come from the east. <laughs> we're going to come from the east. Uh, this is a lot easier to come from this side. You have all these rocks as cover. Even when you're fighting the rogues, you have all this stuff as cover. This wall here and here works really good for cover. You can go back here. There's a lot more options to take cover over there. If you go from this side, this is all open. I mean, there's trees and stuff, but you're pretty much open. Uh, there's not as much cover. It's just not as good. So we are coming from the east. So first thing we want to do is take out the rogues on this roof here, just so they're not a problem. So, you know, when you come up here, and I'm going to show you when we go in game, it's really easy to take this guy out in the gun. There's, I think there's like a metal, um, a metal panel here. Anyway, he can't even see it. You. you can peek his head, easy kill there. And this guy roaming is like dumb. Um, he's easy to take out. Once the, those two are taken out, you don't have to worry about this building at all. After that, we're going to make our way down over here and we're going to start taking out the rogues on this building. So. First one we're going to take out is the one on the roof right here. So again, like I said, there's three on the roof. This guy's over here, so he's not going to bother you. This guy's facing over here. He's not going to bother you. This guy will bother you. So we need to take him out. He's pretty in the open there, so you can take him out pretty easy. So once he's dead, just be aware that this rogue or this rogue, they can hop on this gun. I'd say it's more on the rare side. I kill this guy all the time. Those guys don't usually move over. Sometimes they do. So you just have to keep that in, in, in your head. All right. So we took out our gunner up here. How are we going to take out the roaming patrol? So they can spawn in a bunch of different places. Like I mentioned in the beginning, you really want them to be either spawned here because they're pretty, e if you do this at night, this is really easy. You can be standing right here and the rogues right here and be popping them at night without them shooting back. Right, I'll show you how I did it in the clip. I highly recommend doing this at night. Now, if they they spawn in, in the building, you're going to need to draw them out. So I'd bring a grenade or something like a stun if you don't want to you know, waste uh, money on a, on a real nade. So, you know, you'd have to come in, chuck a grenade, run back out, and hopefully they chase you. Now, if they're on this side, I don't really like when they're on this side because now you have to, you have to worry about the guy on the gun up here. I mean, he's easy to take out, but it's just one thing you have to worry about. And it's kind of hard to fight them on this side. So if they spawn in this side, you could try to draw them over here. But, uh, you know, if you're not comfortable doing that, I would just reset, but I would only really try this if, if you're not comfortable when they're either inside here or in the front here. Because when they're on the side here, it can get complicated. If they're on the side here, they're running around from here to here and it's a, it turns into a pain and we just want to accomplish the quest, right? So if they're here, great. If they're here, great. If they're not, it's okay to reset. You know, we're, this is the easy guy. This isn't trying to like, you know, make it hard. As discussed, we're going to take out the two rogues on the Eastern building first. Like I said, you have one on the gun and then you have one roaming. So there's me taking out the guy on the gun. And then we have the roamer. Who is now dead. Now we're going to move down the hill and we're going to take out the gunner that is on the Northern building facing us. 
right there. Bang, bang, me failing. Now, remember, we're not going to worry about the other two gunners. We just need to keep in mind that those two other gunners can hop on the gun of the rogue we just killed. So just keep that in mind. Now we can clearly see that the rogues are not on this side. So that means they're either inside or on the Western side, or they can be on the Southern side, but they're not. So I need to draw the rogues out of the building. So you can do this a few different ways. Like I said before, Easiest way is to throw a grenade, or you can do what I did and just run in there and run back out. There we go. Like I said, you can use this wall for cover. It works very well. Now, because it's nighttime, look how easy it is to take these guys out. One down. Oh, we hit the rock there. Two down. They don't even know I'm there. Three down, and I'm literally right in front of them. That's why I'm saying. Do it at night, and it's a pretty bright night. You don't even need a thermal here. Now, the last rogue, he wouldn't come out, so we kind of had to just push up. Took him out nice and easy. Now, our quest item is going to be in the office to the right. Now we're heading to the office with our quest item. It is in, it is on the desk inside the little folder holder thing right there. And now we are going to leave the same way we came in. Now, hopefully you have the car extract. If you are going to the car extract, make sure you turn around as hopefully I do make sure that one of those other gunners didn't jump on the uh, gun of the rogue you killed on the roof and barring you running into any player you're all good um, now if you're gonna go northern extract you might run into uh, the back gunner trying to take you out as you move through the train yard but you can easily just take him out no big deal and that is it thank you for watching the video i know it was kind of long but it, this quest isn't as simple as just grabbing the two items you actually have to, to, to kill some rogues and, and use some strategy and it, it's it's kind of a lot for what it is but it is what it is if it, the video helped please leave a like helps with the youtube algorithm and don't forget to subscribe we're almost at 14,300 subscribers and i would love to quit my real life full-time job. Thank you for watching.